Canada is uh, subdivided into uh, uh, different EI regions and I'm always open to looking at uh, ways to improve the way we're, we're serving different communities across the country. There is a limit to how much you can break down different EI regions and still have a, a, a level of integrity in the program as a whole, but, whole, but of course uh, whenever uh, issues like this come up we're, we're happy to uh, hear about ways that these can be approved. The fact is we've strengthened EI for all Canadians, uh, including people here in Edmonton uh, and in Leduc, whether we're talking about uh, shortening the uh, timeline for the delay from two weeks to one weeks in terms of uh, getting your EI, uh, whether it's strengthening the uh, access for new entrants to the workforce or people returning to the workforce, or whether it's looking at stronger work share programs uh, that will last longer. Uh, these are the kinds of things that will make a difference in the lives of everyone. Forty percent of jobs directly related to uh, the oil sands when they were uh, doing well actually happened outside of Alberta. Our heart goes out to all families across this country who are facing real challenges uh, with uh, the crisis that uh, the falling oil prices have led to. That's why in our budget we've not just looked at uh, helping the most hard hit areas and we've identified uh, 12 of those areas across the country that are getting a little extra help, but we've also uh, put forward significant investments in infrastructure right across the country, significant help for middle class families uh, in communities uh, from coast to coast to coast uh, that will uh, help get us through these difficult times and uh, create a stronger, more resilient, more diversified economy uh, in the coming decades. If uh, there was politics brought into this, we might have made other choices. Uh, and the fact is, uh, we can be reassured that uh, we're making things uh, on evidence-based, making decisions based on evidence and not on uh, popularity or political convenience. That's what Canadians expect of this government uh, and I'm, I'm uh, happy to say that uh, we are continuing to base our decisions on, on evidence and facts and make sure that we're uh, helping out the people who need the help the most.